honored to be here today. And uh, I've taken over as the ICA president uh, uh, in May of this year. And this is my public, first public uh, engagement, sir. And I'm very, very happy and honored to be in this grid, you know, kind of promotion uh, meeting today. Very impressed with the, whatever is happening. And if you look at Minister Garu just talking about each and every road in this entire corridor, it's quite amazing how one man can just understand and remember so much. And he can talk with so much of authority. Sir, it's very inspiring. Thank you very much. Well, let me just quickly talk about HiCA. HiCA is a 28-year-old organization, the primary IT industry body of Hyderabad, and it has its own legacy. We are more than 300 uh, member company, representing 90% by revenue and by the employee headcount. So we've been there in the Western Corridor primarily. Sir, so I would like to just you know, like say this to you, that uh, Mr. Jayesh Ranjan has been very, very supportive since we have taken over. The new executive committee has been taken over. And uh, we have formed, we have made two important decisions to be able to promote not only Eastern Corridor and also the other emerging corridors. So one of the main decisions is that we've formed a very exclusive forum within the association its main focus is to be able to develop all the emerging corridors. How do we support emerging corridors to be able to come somewhere closer to Cyberabad? That's exactly our intention. And the second one, to be able to get some representation from the Eastern Corridor, we got two executive committee members uh, representing from Eastern Corridor. One is Manisha from Infosys, and other one is uh, Kishore from Energy Tech Global. It's a mid-sized company, and we want to just plan to get uh, Satish also part of it uh, over a period of time. And I think uh, with all this strategy, we definitely want uh, companies from there visiting here, understand the overall development that is happening here, and the kind of focus that has been put by the government, and also get these guys come out to the Western Corridor to make sure that they present about what are the various, you know, like say, developments, advantages that Eastern Corridor can bring to the table. So it's a kind of, you know, like say, knowledge exchange that we are planning to uh, create, and be able to mobilize everybody to come over. And uh, another important thing, sir, just not stopping with the um, Eastern Corridor, we have just started working towards even the Tier 2 cities. And the uh, Forum for Emerging Corridor is uh, going to be very active as we move forward. And uh, Rajakonda Security Council and uh, Commissioner of Police uh, Rajakonda will be taking their help because they've already created a very good ecosystem in terms of the safety and security. And for that matter, I was part of Cyberabad Security Council. Mr. Mahesh Bhagwat always used to pull me and create this ecosystem here too. So I was becoming part of uh, Rajkonda Security Council. Now I'm also part of Hyderabad City Security Council. And I've been invited for some of the other security councils in the district. So becoming a security council guru, sir, for your kind of information. <laughs> so uh, tier two cities, what we have done is uh, to be able to attract the companies over to the tier two cities or even this part of the city, we want to focus on talent creation. So we have tied up with the Telugu channel. For the last seven weeks, we've been you know, like having one hour sessions on all the emerging technologies. It has had a huge impact. And now we're even thinking about going to some of the colleges with the TV folks and be able to kind of you know, like have multiple workshops to create that talent and, and foster the talent. That's a very, very important goal for us because uh, under the leadership of Jayesh Garu, we've had meetings with TSIC Innovation Council, TASP, J-Hub, and JNTU. And I think we're going to just take this for, for forward and be able to work towards uh, fostering a very good talent ecosystem. And the reskilling, upskilling is going to be a very important uh, target for us. I think with that kind of a context, um, um, HICA will definitely be working very closely with the industry. Thanks to Amar, who's been a great bridge between us, the industry and uh, the ITEC department. We look forward to kind of, you know, like a long association very fruitful association to make sure that you know, like we are going beyond Cyberabad to other parts of you know, like Hyderabad and also the other parts of uh, Telangana. And uh, most importantly today, for your kind of information, Cyberabad, is, the traffic density is so high that there's almost about 1 million people coming in and out of Cyberabad every day. And about close to 1.5 to 2 lakh four-wheelers are just kind of moving around in Cyberabad close to four to five lakh of uh, two-wheelers are you know, coming in and out of Cyberabad. So with so much of traffic uh, density leading to pollution, this part of the city looks awesome. And so we would definitely want people to be able to think from a pollution perspective and also come here for better well-being as well. So with that, um, I conclude. Thank you very much for this opportunity, and I wish the grid policy to come very soon, and we will be very, very closely working with that to make sure 
you know, we develop the industry uh, across Telangana, just not confined to only Cyberabad. Thank you very much, sir.